Bella just came back from school. <laughs> Such a rainy, crappy day today. I got so many chores. You see, it's laundry. Ah, okay. But she made what kind of pie? Cherry. Cherry. <gasps> oh! <laughs> oh, I can't wait to bake it and make it and everything. Did you make all the little lines on the side? Feel it. Yeah, you know, it feels kind of squishy. That's awesome. We'll have dinner and then we'll bake the pie, okay? <laughs> Don't watch your fingers. Miss mm. Ella has uh, math homework every Monday. Sorry, doesn't really want to. There we go. <laughs> Did you get it? So what's the, what do you got to do in this puzzle? And make it like small, medium, large. <laughs> So we do 30 minutes of puzzles every Monday. <laughs> Good job. <laughs> okay guys, today we're gonna do a little bit of makeup shopping. I'm excited. <laughs> um, I did like a super colorful look today. I used Jeffree Star's Jawbreaker palette to do it. And I don't know, I think it came out pretty, um, but we're going makeup shopping because I've kind of like, I haven't been necessarily re-inspired because I've always had a love for makeup, but like recently I've, I felt pretty like discouraged about trying to make my dreams happen here on YouTube, <laughs> um, especially when it comes to like makeup stuff because the majority of my like successful videos are like my vlogs and stuff like that my makeup tutorials don't really do well and that's totally okay um so i had tried to you know make instagram videos but it is so hard to stand out from the crowd so my brother today um who actually has his own youtube channel as well he started not that long ago but my brother was like well are you on tiktok and like TikTok like why would I be on TikTok and he's like no he's like seriously he's like you know there's not that many he's like there's a lot of influencers but like not like what YouTube is not what like Instagram is and he's like give it a try so by the time you guys see this um I am on TikTok now I would have had a couple videos posted like my first two videos you guys might have already seen because I posted those to my Instagram a while ago. They were just saved on my phone and I just wanted to start getting content out there. Oh, wow, <laughs> um, But like, you know, I'm hoping to obviously have more videos. Like I want to post frequently, but like I'm actually doing okay on it. I didn't expect to get like traction on the first day and I'm like, oh my goodness, people are actually watching the content and um, it like, it just really kind of like made me excited because I love sharing my love of makeup with other people. So it kind of inspired me to like not do a natural makeup look every day, which I love. <laughs> I love my natural makeup. Um, but just to like step out of the box, play with more colors. I have so many palettes that need to be played with and stuff. So I just wanted to go to Ulta and just poke around maybe at some like eyeliners or lip colors or like stuff like that. Like I definitely don't need palettes, but I do want to see what's out there and just like create looks every day and have fun making it. Cause it just, it was just, it was getting a little discouraging. I'm like, you know what I mean? Like, what's the point of filming this if nobody's even going to watch it? Like, I'll just do it and just wear it, <laughs> you know? So, it kind of opened up um, my eyes a little bit. Uh, and just kind of, it just kind of put, like, a little pep in my step again. Um, so, my TikTok will be down below with all my social media in every video. Um, I didn't realize that TikTok had bought Musical.ly, and I had Musical.ly years and years and years and years ago so my original username Shazone is not available um i can't figure out how to get onto that old account so now i'm shazo slay <laughs> on tiktok which i thought was hilarious and once again that was my brother's idea so i took that idea and i rolled with it i thought it was hilarious i really liked the play on words so i'm gonna go pick up um tj actually he's home today I'm gonna go pick up him, we're gonna go get Ella, and then we're gonna go to Ulta so I can do some swatching, maybe come up with a couple looks this week. I'm just really excited, and I just wanna like come on here and let you guys know that like TikTok was happening, so if like you have it and you just maybe happen to see me or not confused, 
about why <laughs> why I've never mentioned it. Um, that's why it's new. But I, I'm I'm super excited, and it just I don't know. Like I feel mm, <laughs> I'm excited. I'm just leaving Ulta now. Um, TJ and Ella went to the store right over here. I think it's a um. Sorry. Sorry. I think it's a sporting store that's closing down, so we kind of um, split. So he took Ella so I could calmly browse. <laughs> oh, what are you doing? <laughs> She's excited. Why? <gasps> What's that? A fuzzy pet. Fuzzy pet. We got to go to the mall and it pick up our computer. A, I don't know how much it is. A lot of money. Matt, as how always, much, appreciate your money, advice in this department. I have, like, no say in this. So. <laughs> how much money you got? I have zero money. Oh. I just spent it all. Oh. But I got a coin. <laughs> you have a penny? <laughs> yeah. Do I have coin? Yeah. Um, at home? Good. Look at my hand. I did a lot of swatching. But I got a little bit of makeup. I'm super excited. I'll be able to make a look tomorrow. <laughs> <laughs> what are you doing? Don't like my camera. Okay, guys. Um, it's actually nearing the end of the night. Um, oh, you can see that. Let's <laughs> go. Probably. <laughs> the one night that TJ decided, can you please get your foot Ooh, out of the video? <laughs> and the one night he decides to come to bed. Careful! <laughs> oh my god! <laughs> Are you serious? I hope you keep, keep that in your video. Keep it under the covers, please. I, keep, I hope you keep that you're in the video. You're disgusting. Everybody knows you're gross. Oh my god! I have to do laundry in the morning, so uh, my cat's freaking chasing. <laughs> Arrow. <laughs> You don't want to smell them, buddy. Oh my god. My phone is about to die, mind you. I'm gonna go get in the shower. Um, but I really wanted to film this. <laughs> <laughs> I really can you please get your foot out of the thank you. I I hate him so much. Um I'm really trying to film this before my stupid phone dies. So if my phone dies, I'm going to be pretty pissed. Um, I'm about to go downstairs and <laughs> I need to go downstairs and shower. But I bought, because we got rid of, oh my God, it smells so bad, guys. <laughs> you have no idea. Um, we got rid of a desk that was over here because it was taking up a lot of room. But I enjoy filming up here from time to time because like during the day, um, I have this big balcony window. So I get a lot of arrow. I have something for you to bite. I get a lot of like really nice natural lighting in here. So sometimes I'll film downstairs, sometimes I'll film up here. I'm actually thinking about bringing my backdrops up here too. Um, so I went to Target earlier and I found it's basically like, <laughs> it's just a, what is it, a TV tray? Um, but all my makeup is up here too. So I figured instead of like, if I want to film more tutorials for Instagram and TikTok and stuff, like I don't want to have to drag stuff back and forth. Plus it's really hard to like, remember what you actually have to use it. So I want to have like a little setup up here where I could use the natural lighting and then like have my makeup right there at my disposal. Um, you saw the brief mess over here. This is still all Hunter stuff that like I, I've gone through, but I need to like find a home for it. So temporarily it's sitting here, but that'll all be moved. Um, but I'm going to set this up real quick because I also want to show you guys what I got earlier from the Ulta, um, do like a little haul and swatching because tomorrow I have a baby appointment. As soon as I drop Ella off at school, I have to fly up to my appointment. Like I called out of work and everything tomorrow because by the time I would get to work, like I'd have to leave 
soon anyways to pick Ella up because it's kind of far. Um, so I just ended up calling out. So I'm going to take advantage and I'll have a little bit of time. So I'm going to film tomorrow. So I'm going to be super, super busy. Um, so I don't know what kind of time I'm going to have to show you guys. And I'm planning on using some of these products in tomorrow's video. So I just want to be able to kind of haul everything. Um, is this going to be tall enough? Let me see. It was only $10. I didn't want to spend a lot of money on a table, but I wanted something that would be easy to move. Um, yeah, this might actually be tall enough. Let me see. Let me go grab my chair and see. Okay, so I actually think that this table will work. Um, it looked a little small, but it also was sitting on the ground. Hi, bud. <laughs> my cat's like, what's going on? Obviously, I wouldn't vlog here. This is just for today. Um, I would have my tripod set up and everything, so it'd be a little bit higher. But I need to stop rambling because I'm telling you. What's the matter, Bubba? Hi, Annie. Here, go see Daddy. He's nice and smelly for you. Um, <laughs> let me show you. Don't even think about it. He wants to go on this table. Let me show you guys what I got at Ulta so that I can go shower and uh, get some videos edited while I'm at it. Is that everything? I think so. Okay. So I got quite a bit actually. Um, I always want to get more, but <laughs> I settled. <laughs> Let's get through this. Um, so the first thing I got was, I'm not going to be able to swatch this because it's a lot of plastic, but I just picked up a NYX eyeliner pencil in teal. I just really like the color. I want to use it for my waterline and potentially eyeliners as well. Um, I got two new Morphe brushes. Neither I've owned um, one is a little tiny angle brush and I got this cause you're going to see another product I got too. Um, but it's this teeny tiny little, I mean, it is so small. Um, it's for like gel liners and stuff. So I'm super excited to use that. I don't know if this will be used in tomorrow's tutorial or the tutorial after that. Like I have like kind of two tutorials planned on filming and I don't know which one I'm going to do tomorrow. Um, and then, the, so that was, I'm sorry, that was the Morphe 217 brush. And this is the Morphe, uh, I can't see that number yet. Uh, the M431 Precision Pencil Crease Brush. I have a brush similar to this, which is like one of my all time favorites, but this one just seemed a little bit shorter and kind of perfect to get right into that crease. Um, so those are the two brushes that I got. Sorry, my ring keeps turning, driving me nuts. Um, and then I got, I'll show you this, it's the NYX Vivid Brights. It's kind of like a burgundy color. So I know we're like in that weird transition. It's like still fall, but it's like snowing in some places and the holidays are coming. So this color is super popular. Um, so I wanted to get this and it's kind of like a, a pot, like a liner pot so that's honestly specifically why I got that brush but I'll definitely use it in the future again um but I just want to give it a quick try and see what the what the pigmentation is like so I would take this little brush and we'll just do a quick swatch Ooh, nice okay and it is the color that I was looking for a lot of the burgundies that I swatched in store kind of came off a little um red to be honest with you, this is definitely, uh, it seems a little chunky to be honest with you. Um, but maybe I put too much product on the brush because the more I'm working it in, the smoother it's coming out. So I don't know. I just figured it'd be a really, really pretty color to do um, an eyeliner look with. And the last four products I got were actually all from ColourPop and three of them are lip products. Um, so I, I guess I'll show you this first because this is the first highlighter that I've ever purchased from ColourPop. Um, it's kind of like I was testing it in the store and it's kind of like a creamy material. So it's similar to the Super Shock Shadows, um, just a little bit bigger, but it twists off the same way. And then this is in the color Flexitarian. <laughs> um, so I'll give it a quick swatch. Holy smokes. Uh, it's super, super pretty. It looks a bit light. Um, 
especially when I'm tanning and stuff, but like I could totally see myself using this as an eyeshadow too. But again, I have like a specific look coming in mind. So I wanted to get it. And it's not like, it's kind of coming off white on camera, but in person, it's kind of like a really light champagne-y color. Um, so super pretty and I'm excited to actually give that a try on my face. And then quickly, the three lip products is one is two of them i should say are the ultra matte lips i don't know if these are from specific collections or these are just currently color pops packaging i'm not quite sure but this one is in the color called know it all and i think this is the burgundy yeah it's like a burgundy color so i wanted to pair this with the lip liner or the eyeliner that i just showed you guys well that's actually a really good color match so there's the eyeliner and then there's the matte liquid lipstick so that it's perfect for the look that I want to create. And then the other matte lip I got, this one wasn't specifically for a look, but I just, I love matte, matte lipsticks and I swatched it and thought it was super pretty. This is called Growing Pains and I could definitely see myself using this as like an everyday color. It's kind of like a nude mauve. I'm sure I have colors similar, but <laughs> I thought it was really pretty. Um, I don't think I own like that specifically in my collection. So, you know, ColourPop is so affordable that it's like, it's not a big deal. Anyways, the last thing I got um, was actually an ultra glossy lip from ColourPop. Same packaging. I've never tried their lip glosses because I had, you know, if you followed me over the past couple months, um, I've been getting more into lip glosses. Still love my mattes, but um, this was actually specifically for a look as well. Um, but I got it because I knew I would probably use it in the future too. But it's just like this clear gloss, but it's super um, shimmery. Like it has a lot of sparkles in it. I don't know what's going to show up on camera, but you can see it underneath the Growing Pains color. It's just really, really, really shiny. I guess I'll swatch it on my lips real quick just because I don't have anything else on. So yeah, it's just, it's a it's a basic clear lip gloss, but surprise, surprise, I actually don't own one. <laughs> so that was all the stuff that I got today. I'm glad that I got to show you guys and get that out of the way. Um, of course, the baby appointment, if it's not in this vlog, um, just look out for it next vlog. I update you guys about what's going on. I don't think it's, ooh, I don't think it's going to be a super crazy appointment because I had all my shots a couple weeks ago, but, um, you know, they're going to check the heartbeat and everything and all that fun stuff. So oh, that's it. I have heartburn now. This child gives me heartburn at night. I can't <laughs> stop. All right. I'll see you guys. I'll talk to you guys really, really soon. I wish I started vlogging like two minutes earlier <laughs> i um i talked about this guy at mcdonald's and like we love getting mcflurries so we won't necessarily eat at mcdonald's but we'll get like ice cream once in a while so we're in the drive-thru right now coming back from a play place we're at the play place for like literally three hours yeah, and i've been there for so long i know we were there for a long time so we're just getting like a quick snack um, we're gonna have dinner like in a little while at my mom's but I mentioned this guy at McDonald's who always oh, like never fails if he's at the drive-thru he always says you look amazing by the way and I'm like ah like you tell me this like three times a week <laughs> not that often but like every time I see him so I'm oh like oh my god this car is so long I don't know, maybe he's getting a lot of food, girlfriend. This one car, we just paid. The guy was working the pay counter. And now we're getting... I we're, food. It looks like he's getting a lot of food, baby. Maybe not. Maybe he just came. Maybe. No, but they missed something. <laughs> maybe it's hard to make. I just wish I, um, I turned on the camera. Oh. I wish I turned on the camera. I'm like hungry. I wanted to get something, but we're gonna have Chinese at my mom's tonight. Hi. Yes, please. Thank you. Thank have a great night. You too. Here you go, baby. Here's your Oreo. Mm. Um. <laughs> so we're gonna head home. Just like I said, we we're there forever. Ah. So I want to go home and get some chores done. 
Um, Wait a minute. But I still have to. What, babe? We're at that place for well, 10 minutes. No, we were there for almost three hours. I had brought my computer and my phone, so I got like a lot of editing done, but man, did my back hurt. Um, yeah, and then my mom saw me went down a lava slide. Yeah, you went down a big fire slide. It was super cool, but... No, it's lava. No, sorry, lava. <laughs> um, I do have that Christmas tree, though, that we're donating to the school's festival of trees still at my mom's, and I didn't show you guys that. I, I just totally forgot when we were working on it, so I'll make sure that... I get like a quick view of it. I don't think you'll be able to see it very well, to be honest, because it's tucked into a corner, but, but I'll make sure that you guys see it at some point. It's very cool, but it's just a Christmas tree at the same time, so nothing crazy. But I wanna get home. I'm sure Arrow is not happy with me. He's been outside all day in the rain, so I'm sure he's gonna want um, dinner and to come in. What, what honey? Maybe he wants to go inside. <laughs> I'm sure he does. I wouldn't blame him. He's been outside since, um, I want to say 11 today and it's 4, so he's probably uh, soaking wet I would say 100. and exhausted. 100? Mm -hmm. Straight up here at Target <laughs> and someone just came up to me asking if I worked here. Does it look like I'm working? I almost Guys, I just got out of work. Like, I'm a mess. My shirt's a mess. I'm a mess. I'm not wearing red. How do I look like... I thought it was hilarious. <laughs>